everybody. Today I want to talk to you about a new Alfred workflow that I recently discovered. It's a workflow that will allow you to run shortcuts from your Mac uh, relatively easy through just doing a simple search. So let's get on with the demonstration. So the first thing I would do is pull up Alfred and then I would type SC to call that particular workflow. SC and then spacebar. You should see all the um, workflows that I've created. And this is the one that we're going to try out today. So I'm going to hit calculate tip and hit enter. So let's say your bill is uh, $45. And then you hit done. And then I'm going to tip 15% because I never go anymore unless they're really, really good. And then I'm going to hit done again. And then you, here you get your tip as $6.75 with your total being $51.75. All right. So that's the demonstration of the shortcut. Obviously, um, now it just goes back to normal once you hit OK because that, um, that shortcut has ran. Obviously, when you do the SC and spacebar, you you see here all the folder or all the shortcuts that you have. Um, you can have is a lot, and some of these obviously don't work on Macs. They're specific to iOS, but this. Um, this workflow gives you an easy way to run them. Otherwise, you would have to run them from, I believe it's up here. If you go to um, my bartender here. And I know it's just somewhere, but I'm not sure where. Oh, here it is, yes. So here's the one that you have to set to be in the drop-down menu. From the editing um, platform of the shortcut. With this workflow, you can see all the workflows that you have relatively quickly. So that that's really, really cool. And where you can get it from is from a um, pretty awesome Mac enthusiast call, uh, website called Thoughts Asylum. And you can see that website right here. And here is the shortcut. It's a, I'm not sure if this gentleman is a developer, but I know he's helped me with, um, several um, Mac problems. I've downloaded stuff for him, from him for drafts and now um, shortcuts. He's a, I would go through this website. He has a lot of cool stuff and his link will be in the description below for this website. All right, guys. Um, that's what I have for today. Please like, subscribe, and comment and share this uh, video to somebody who might like to learn more about Alfred Workflows. All right, guys, I'll see you all in the next video.